not a fancy gym. Like, like this is not pretty much for the show. It's for the trainer and for the women and stuff. I started boxing because like, I wanna. I, I didn't wanna stay in the house all day. And I used to be real big, and I wanna get there. I didn't wanna stay in the house all day and play video games. But I want. I saw I wanna play a sport. Though. Every other kid was playing football and basketball. So I wanna try something else. Yes, bro. Oh no, they, uh, I talked to her one day in a drugstore. She was asking about can he come down here and train. I said, yeah, anytime, you know. And then when he came down here, you know, took a liking to him, like his like son, you know what I mean? And he mommy of my other son, the oldest one, Pooh. So that's why I started training him. You, you, you can see he got the skills, he got everything. You know what I mean? Good listener, you know what I mean? Moves, you see the moves he got, good moves, yeah. you know what I mean? Hard to hit. And that's what I teach. The last gym that he was in really couldn't um, take him to the next level. You know, they when he came in, he already knew how to throw his hands. And that's one thing. It was just working with him with, with what he already knew. They wasn't taking him to the next level at all. One of the ladies up in front of my um, pharmacy said, well, why are you going to talk to Bo? Because, you know, Miss Dorothy is his mom. She said, you know, he oh, he got he runs a gym around there. And I'm like, get out. So, what a coincidence, a couple minutes later, Bo walks in. And I showed him the video footage off, off, of the, off my phone. But my son had just won the silver gloves. So, Bo was like, well, what a coincidence. I saw him. He stole my style. You know, he said, I want that little guy anyway. So, you know, we brought him around here. And then, you know... You know, like Bo said, he, he's a spitting image of his older son. The, he, a lot of things that he does in life, like playing a guitar, the flute, you know, basketball, it comes to him so easy. And each thing, like each, each um, sport that he does, he, he loves, you know, or just something about boxing. He's not from the hood. He never lived in the hood. So he don't have that anger. He just found the sport that he liked and, and he just went with it. So he, he's not hungry. He's not hungry for the, the wins. He, it's just something that he likes to do, and it just so happened that the wins come naturally, which is something that he likes to do. You know, I, I think that out in the street world, he get like street credit, although he's like a geeky nerd, you know, in school. But out on the streets, his name is Meatballs is all out there, and he has a hunger for. He the one that tells me, "Mom, it's five o'clock." You know, I'm the one that's running late. You know, he he he's the one making sure. And, and even even when I'm still at work, when I have to say my job later. He'll run. He ran from German, from Vernon Road in Providence all the way to the gym. Him and his older brother. I'm just playing on being the next Floyd Mayweather. Everybody want to be Floyd nowadays. Like, if you like, if you really want to be a boxer, you should go like way back to like Prince Nazim, Pano, whatever. All them. I want to be. I want to be on that level.